Oh, it's so much better with light on. What do we have today? Okay, I have a really cool science experiment that deals with fire a little bit. So we're gonna talk about combustion and you need three things in order to light this. We need heat, we need fire, we need oxygen, which we have in the air, and we need a fuel source, okay? So, you ready? I'm gonna light this with my lighter. Okay, all right, and then I'm going to put out the flame with this foil. Don't try this at home, I don't want you to get burned. And then I'm going to relight it by lighting the smoke. Did you catch that? Wasn't that super cool? It also reminds me of what God has done for us. So remember, when God made the world, he said, let there be light, and there was light. But then sin entered the world and snuffed out the light. But because of Jesus, we have light again. He doesn't leave us in the darkness, which is such a wonderful, wonderful thing. So Ephesians 5, 8 says, for once you were full of darkness, but now you have the light from the Lord. So live as people of the light. Exactly. That's exactly what we need to do. Jesus gave us light and we should go out to the world and spread that to others. And so if you know someone whose light is burning out, maybe they just are holding on to a dim little flame, help them. Go to them, share God's love with them. Y'all have a great day.